Hello everyone, welcome back to Hotline Topics. The star veteran actress Peju Ogumola Emotional as her only son makes her proud. Peju is from a family of highly respected experience. In fact, many were surprised but elated when she followed the path of the ones before her. Her father, Kuala Ogumola, was one of the Nollywood giants during this time and they laid the foundation for what the industry is today. Uh, meanwhile, her brother, Yomi Ogumola, was also a force to reckon with. The movie star contributed the school just to the growth of the industry during his lifetime. It is always a thing of pride when the offsprings of Thespians follow their path in the entertainment industry. In our own case, Peju conceived a dream about acting at a very tender age of 8, about the time she had sadly lost her father, and she got married in her mid-twenties to the Nollywood giant Sunday Mobola Lewis probably called Alue as a second wife. Peju got her very first role as Kadara in Adi Love in 1979 during her secondary school days, and in 1982, a role was scripted for her as Mero in Jai Simi Ba and then in 1983, Peju alongside her siblings, uh, the children of the late uh, Kola Ogumola went on stage to commemorate a decade of her father's death with Aditolo Dumari. After main friend's movie of Koshedbe, where she played a high society lady called Silifa, Peju moved from being an actress to producing her own film, uh -huh, which she dedicated to her father. While this was followed by another one, Ojoy Kunle, deeply entrenched in the industry by her third decade, she featured in or acted as major protagonist of several home video films, which became a mainstay. Of Nigerian film industry in the 1990s. Even though this actress does not really reveal so much about herself, in fact, her year of birth is stated as unknown on many sites. However, since she joined the movie industry around the time that she had lost her father when she was just eight years old, according to some sources, and then she celebrated her father's remembrance um, early this year, January, that would make her to be in her late 50s or early 60s. For so many years, many people did not really know Pojo Kumula's only son, her only child. In fact, um, many people didn't even know that she was the second wife of Alue. The first wife sadly passed on some years ago. And together, Alue and the first wife had about three kids, and Pojo has only one son. But then we all thought Pojo was the mom of all of them. Their names are Sukomi Mobolanli, Victoria Mobolanli, Bilu, and Kemi Olayemi. And among those kids, the only one who had followed the path of their father in the movie industry is Sukomi Mobolanli. And because of their relationship and the skin complexion, we all thought that um, Peju was the mom of Sukomi Mobolanli. Until recently that Peju started sharing some photos and some things about her son on her social media platform. And recently, the actress was not short of praises at all on her only son, who is making her proud in the entertainment industry. However, this young man did not follow the acting uh, side of the industry movies. No, he's not an actor. He's rather into the music part of the industry. And according to this star actress, her son is the best thing that has ever happened to her. She admires the strong and intelligent man that he has become today. His name is Ayomiku Okikiola Omobolani. Recently released one of his works, Sally Bramos and Beju was all over social media platforms praising her son and celebrating him for making her proud. Well, congratulations to Beju Ogumola and her son. Ayomiko. There are many other actors who their uh, kids are following their path in the entertainment industry. Some are even lucky that they get their kids to follow them in the acting part of the industry. Such was the case of uh, the uh, Afolayo, the veteran actor, Adeyemi Afolayo, which is probably called Adelove. In fact, most of his kids followed his footsteps in the entertainment industry. Adeyemi Afolayo was a prominent film actor, producer, and director. He's one of the founding fathers of the uh, Yoruba movie industry. He was born in 1940 and passed away in 1996. He's the brother of the popular Nigerian actress Tony Afolayo. Adeyemi is the father of the outstanding Nigerian actors Gabriel Afolayo, Kunle Afolayo, Arima Afolayo, and the lovely actress Moji Afolayo. His sister Tony Afolayo is probably called Lola Idije. She's a prominent actress who became famous in 1995. At the time, Tony Afolayo stayed as Madame Adisa in Deadly Affair. And his son, Gabriel Afolayo, is one of the top actors in the entire Nigerian movie industry, not just in the Uber sector. He's mostly known as G Fresh. He's also a musician. This Nigerian sing singer and actor is another famous representative 
and is widely loved. He studied theater arts at the University of Ibadan, and in 2012, he won the Best Supporting Actor Award for Teva Jambari in Udrush. Gabriel has a lot of songs that he has released so far, and the other uh, movie star who is also an Afolayo is the actor Arimu Afolayo. He's a well-known Nigeria award-winning director and uh, a film actor. Aremu is from Ibumino Yoba ancestry uh, and he became famous in Nigeria after filming in Damu Akuto in 2009. The other movie star who is also an Afolayan is Muji Afolayan. She is the only daughter of Adilov. She was born in 1969. And this movie star attended Koka Primary School before she proceeded to ACA Ludo Anglican School where she got the West African School Certificate. However, she did not want to become a teacher. So she rather delved into the industry. In 2016, Afanaya stared opposite Delo Dule and Oju Pagogo in the prominent Yoruba movie Arijo. Her husband is Razak Olayiwola Ola Sukami, who is also called Oju Pagogo, and they have some lovely kids together. The other actor who is a strong figure in the Nigerian movie industry is Kunle Afolayo. Kunle Afolayo is one of the top producers as well. He was one in 1974. He took some courses at the New York Film Academy and since 2005, his career has been growing rapidly. He has been dropping top movies, including Figurine, Aru Mire, and his movies usually win many awards, both the national awards and the international awards. But there are many other families too who are lucky for their kids to follow their footsteps and in fact the Kosoko families are also there. Kosoko is lucky to have two kids who have followed his footsteps. Jide Kosoko is one of the veterans who started acting very early around the age of 10 to 15. So he joined the movie industry quite early and his late wife Enrietta Kosoko was also a star actress before she sadly passed on. And Jide Kosoko is lucky to have two girls who had followed his path. Shola Kosoko and Bidemi Kosoko. They've successfully carved niche for themselves in the entertainment industry. The other veteran who is lucky to have uh, the kids follow the footsteps in the entertainment industry is the actor Adebayo Salami, who is probably called Ogabelu. Ogabelu has trained many superstars in this industry and he's lucky to have many of his kids follow his footsteps, especially the, the men. He has 14 kids, 7 women and 7 men. They are all grown. And the most known of them is Femi Adebayo. He's probably called Jelili or Jelili Onisu. So these are some of those veterans who are lucky to have their kids follow their footsteps in the entertainment industry. And some of them are lucky to join the movie industry and even make it big. And we'll come to the end of this episode where the veteran actress Beju Ogumola flaunts her son as he makes her proud in the entertainment industry. We hope you enjoyed this episode. Please subscribe and hit the bell icon for our daily content.